melelosi vagarosis. Malanana marabadori adisanant. What is the land? What is the land? You to your holy name for you are holy thank you for who you are thank you for your loving kindness thank you for your mercies towards us oh god who believe thank you lord thank you for your mercies towards us who believe thank you lord thank you for your cleansing power thank you for your goodness Thank you, Lord. Be exalted forevermore. Be magnified, my King, in the name of Jesus Christ we have worshipped. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Amen. I welcome you to the altar of prayer today. Hallelujah. To the place of covenant prayer. Amen. Indeed, you are welcome. Child of God, thank you for coming to pray with me today. Amen. Glory to God. Wow, mighty God. Yes, I came up a little bit late. I had a little uh, situation, but thank God that we are good. Amen. God be praised. Thank you for standing with me in the place of prayer. Uh, please do invite someone. Hallelujah. Uh, early hours of today, uh, uh, he woken up my ears to hear just the word, monitoring spirits. Hmm. 
monitoring spirits. And today, we will do warfare. We will come against the activities. We will bind. We will stop. Oh yes, we will charge today against monitoring spirits. Yes, there are spirits that monitor men. There are spirits that follow people about. There are unclean spirits, demonic spirits, spirits of the devil. Yes, they are called monitoring spirits, just like the name sounds. Monitoring spirits, they monitor, they trail, they trace, they follow. Familiar spirits, they don't go away. Amen. So today we will be praying. We will be rising up in the place of prayer. For the spirit of the Lord have touched lighted today. Yes, this set of demonic spirits and beings that we must arrest today. Mm, they must get off our trail in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah to God. Turn your Bibles with me to first, or not first, Hebrews chapter 1. And I read it again and wondered, hmm, Hebrews chapter 1, verse 13 and 14. The Bible said, But to which of the angels said he at any time, Sit on my right hand until I make thine enemies thy footstool? Are they not all ministering spirits? sent forth to minister for them who shall be heirs of salvation. Take note of that scripture. There are sometimes when we read the Bible, we, we gloss over it. We are not careful to read in between the lines. We are not careful to, to read, to understand. I want to read verse 14 again. Okay, let me read it from verse 13. He said, but to which of the angels said he at any time? All right. Now, that sentence tells us that there are beings that are called angels. And of course, this is no strange information to you, child of God, that angels are. They are angels. You read the Bible, you hear the story of angels. they are are angels, beings created by God that are not humans, beings created by God that minister to God. The Bible said that the train of God is a thousand on thousand and thousands of thousands of angels. Oh yes, there are angels. All right. Now, he says, which of them did God say? Sit on my right hand until I make thine enemies thy footstool. Which of the angels have God ever said to sit at my right hand? None. None. In other words, angels are not sons of God. Angels are not, are not in the same class with the Son of God. For it is his son, Jesus. He said, sit thou at my right hand until I make thine enemy your footstool. And Jesus came and raised us also as sons of God. For we are seated with him, the Bible said, in heavenly places far above principalities and powers. Glory to God. So again in the hierarchy is God and then his sons, praise God. So you and I are higher in rank or in ranking than angels as sons of God. Yes, angels are powerful beings. Angels are spirits created by God as it were, glory to God, that do mighty things and mighty acts. Yes, in this realm of life and in the spirit realm, they are gigantic beings. God had granted me the privilege of seeing 
angels. I can tell you, those encounters changed my life, changed my perception of the spiritual. Mm -hmm. Angels are massive beings, powerful and strong, just like the devil is also a spirit that is strong. Because in the in in the angelic hierarchy, there are there, there is there, there are classes of angels. In the spirit, there are classes of spirits. Praise the Lord. Glory to God. I, I didn't come here to discuss spirits per se, uh, but I came to give you an insight so we can pray today. The Bible said that angels are not equal with the sons of God. That's the point. Angels are not equal with sons of God are higher than angels. He said, to which of the angels did he say, sit down at my right hand until I make thine enemy your footstool? In fact, the book of Revelation tells us how it was that John had an encounter with an angel and he bowed to worship that angel. And the angel said, no, 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 no. You don't worship me. We worship God. Yes, we don't worship angels. We don't worship them. We worship God who is worthy of worship, who demands of us worship. Hallelujah. So angels are there not for you to worship. Praise God. Angels are there not for you to serve. Angels are there not for you to, as it were, obey, they give you commandments. No, as a son of God, you are higher than angels. But hear this in verse 14. The Bible said of uh, Hebrews chapter 1, verse 14, he said, Are they not all ministering spirits? Again, all the angels are ministering spirits. They are servant spirits, as it were. All the angels, both the archangels, the seraphims, the cherubims, these are different classes of angels, principal spirits. Yes, hallelujah. Glory to God. Principal spirits. Yes, and I hope you know that it is principal spirits that are in charge of territories and domains. Mm. For we are told that we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities and powers. Hallelujah. I was listening to, I was listening to an interview that the late uh, 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 singer uh, Whitney Houston uh, granted uh, her interviewers in those days. And she made a sentence that resonated in my spirit. He said that the madness is in the territory. When she was being quizzed by the journalist about uh, her drug addiction, praise God, and uh, the life of fame and the life of yeah, uh, that kind of life. Uh, and she said that the madness is in the territory. Uh, and I understood exactly what she was saying. Praise the Lord. For every territory, there are, there are, there are principalities in charge of those territories. And for you, child of God, to prevail in territories whatever territory and wherever territory you find yourself child of god you must contend with the principality with the prince of that territory and subdue my god the prince of that territory must know that you are there yes for every territory and every society is influenced by the principality that rule in that place. Don't forget this. Mm -hmm. I bring influences upon the land and upon the people. So whatever territory and wherever territory you find yourself as a son of God, you must have this understanding 
to attend to the territorial spirit in the place, my God, who Velenesa, to attend to speak in the to ascend in your office, in your place as a kingly priest, as a priest and as a king. Ahadada, Taria Saneta. Oh, Uhuli Minige, Azavis. Yes. There are demonic spirits that are principalities. And she said that the madness is in the territory. Oh, glory to God. There are territories you can break into until you subdue the, the principality in that territory. You can't take territories. Jesus said so. He said no man can spoil the a good or the good of a strong man without first of all binding the strong man before he can spoil his goods. Glory to God. <laughs> but I, I, I'm not exactly dealing with taking tele territories today. That, that, that's not the issue today. Hallelujah to Jesus. In the scriptures where we just read, uh, Hebrew chapter 1 verse 14, it says that they are all ministering spirits, angels, angelic beings. Yes, the good spirits that are with God in heaven. The Bible said that they are all ministering spirits. Yes, sent forth sent forth to minister to attend to oh yes for them the minister for them the minister for them the minister for them that's the word the minister for them who shall be heirs of salvation and we are the heirs of salvation glory to god so ministering spirits Spirits from God, angelic beings, are all ministers sent to minister for me, sent to attend to my matters, sent to take instructions and carry them out on my behalf, sent to do what humans cannot do, sent to attend to spiritual matters, my God. Oh, yes, angels can be deployed for a people. Angels can be deployed for a man. Angels can minister to a man. The Bible said so. Oh, yes, spirits, angelic spirits can minister to a man. We see that in Matthew chapter 11, verse, Matthew chapter 4, verse 11. Mm -hmm. The Bible said in Matthew chapter 4, verse 11, look at it. Someone may wonder, can angels minister to a human being in this realm? Yes, in the now, yes. Angels still minister to men, still minister to human beings. Oh, yes, yes. Now, we read in the Bible and it, it looks like it, it is something uh, that happened in the days. It, it is no longer a reality of today. Child of God is not true. Angels still maroon the earth in our time I, I didn't come to preach so i don't begin to elongate this section yes i just came to ins give us the word that we may pray glory to god in verse 11 of chapter 4 the bible said then the devil lived him and behold angels came and ministered unto him angels came and ministered unto him those those spirits minister to men yes those angels minister to men yes angels came and ministered to jesus now if you also read luke chapter 22 and in verse 43 in the garden of gethsemane when jesus went to pray and he prayed and prayed the bible said in verse 43 that angels came and strengthened him angels came and ministered to him angels came and strengthened him in the place of prayer hallelujah angels and ministering spirits sent to minister to the heirs 
of salvation. Glory to God. And today we are going to pray that there will be heavy deployment of angels in the now. Oh, God, that heaven will deploy angels. Hallelujah. And in praying from this ministering spirits to be attended to us in praying and asking of heaven that this spirit Spirits that are powerful beings be deployed as it were. We will also be dealing with other spirits. Yes, of particular interest today is familiar spirits and monitoring spirits. Mm, there are monitoring spirits. There are familiar spirits that come to do havoc to the people of God and today we will stand up in the place of prayer and we shall address these unclean spirits and their activities around our lives and that around our portion in the name of Jesus glory to God can we begin to bless the Lord in thanksgiving just lift your voice and tell the Lord thank you glory glory be to the lord hallelujah go ahead and bless the name of the lord give god thanks and give him praise he is worthy i don't start praying without first of all thanking god it is the protocol of heaven when we come to pray jesus said when you pray pray to us our father who art in heaven hallowed be your name can we bless the lord in thanksgiving child of god lift up your voice and just give him thanks give him thanks and give him praise he is worthy have no shining at the other be brothers thank you father thank you for who you are glory to god holy holy is the lord god almighty in amanasas the one who saved us, the one who died for us and lifted us up to sit with him in heavenly places far above principalities and powers. Glory to God. You are worthy, my father. Master, I give you thanks and praise. Strengthen me to pray today, my father. Strengthen me to pray today, my God. Strengthen me to pray today. Give ear to our prayers, O oh God, I pray. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Glory to God. In Exodus chapter 23 and in verse number 20, the Bible said, Exodus 23 verse 20, it is written, Behold, I send an angel before thee, my God, to Keep thee in the way and to bring thee into the place which I have prepared. To keep thee in the way and to bring thee into the place which I have prepared, my God. That place that the Lord has prepared for you, my God. That portion that you must have, my Father. He said to us, it's a season of compounded harvest. And then he said, I send an angel. I send an angel, glory to God, before thee to go, to bring it, to make it happen for you. Open your mouth, therefore, and begin to ask the Lord, let your angels go before me in this season. Through the remaining days of the year, let your angel, my father, send the angels to go before me to ensure that my compounded harvest come to me. Open your mouth and pray. That prepared place. Ah, Zasaria, let the Lord assign an angel now, Unte Kupakata, to bring it to pass, to make it happen. Nekuzasa Parabilikiti. Let the angel of the Lord be sent, my God. Yea, my father, I make the mans of heaven. Uzonkotie Garitas, Zebrote Leberi di Gagadi Agaboso, Sopene di Akiadis, Zebre de Bembrediti, Mavia. Go se te lehi gati gati gata abre de siri ti piti yata makuma ruba supete my father my father send oh God the akus sasante paradikata let there be a deployment.
deployment of heavenly emissaries. Let there be a deployment of angels for me, for us, for the ministry, for our families, my father, for my family, for my home. Yes, Lord. Ye compounded harvest it shall be. Akaturi sai. To bring it to pass and make it happen. In the Sasana Madabanas. Ye dio barali skote kepeketis. Zasabarabadiya di bakatapakata. My father, my father. Ete pepe tete tepe ketia gabaragi soko soko. Otini ba la trede se senge tiagina. Imene susu bredi bakaburu gede begede gede. Aboporo bakatapakatu bede yakati yagada. Eke so so. Begin to demand that there will be a deployment of angels. Glory to God. For you in this season, yes. Ibada bada. To bring you into that prepared place, yes. That which have been determined by heaven to be in my life. It's a season of joy. Yes. Let the angels be deployed, my father. Hado pere katatatatayata parapa katakatata in the name of Jesus Christ. In that same scriptures, he said, I've sent my angels. I've sent the angels to go with thee, that they may keep you in the way. They may keep you in the way. That's what the Bible said. That they may keep you in the way and bring you into the place. They will keep you in the way. I need you to pray and ask that the Lord, my God, let the angels of the Lord go with me and go with my children all the days of their lives to keep us in the way, my God. God, there is a way. <laughs> Child of God, there is a way. They will keep us in the way. Jesus said, I am the way. There is a way. The Bible said that the labor of the fool weary them <laughs> because they know not the way to the city. There is a way. Let the angel of the Lord lead us in the way. Hamdo parapata pata. Keep us in the way that our feet slip not. My God, dear Dada Sotapa. Yeah, keep my children in the way. Adada dear diaka da bakuria sha. Egube dube kuperege nege diaga da badas. Yes, keep my wife in the way. Adum dilata tata pakata. Keep me, Lord, in the way. Yana pata pata. Send your angels ahead. Ide gede 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 parapaka. Yes, Lord, according to the scriptures, ye borrow the Messiah, for they are ministering spirits unto me. In the da 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 da, I come as a sublete, a grogo bege de yaga bege de yaga da bada. I para pa kata pa ta pa ta yaga ba kuriya bere de bege de ga ikata. Sanson bere ni pri de kete bege de yoga bri yaga vaga da bada sa. Sanson te pa li ati kapa katu pari de bege de itasa. I pelune my father yante yaka. I ask for angelic assistance. Can you please begin to pray? The Bible said in Hebrew chapter 1 verse 14 that they are ministering spirits. Are they not all ministering spirits to them who shall be heads of salvation? Heads of salvation. Glory to God. Begin to request and demand for angelic assistance in this season, my God. The angels of the Lord will help you. Rapata, the man for celestial help. Help coming to you from the sanctuary. I go to Pekete Pete. My father, my father, Yala Grie Kute Pekete. Angels were deployed and they brought down the walls in Jericho. Yeah, the walls did not come down by human effort. Glory to God. Begin to pray for angelic deployment. Concerning you, concerning. 
concerning your matters, concerning your home, concerning your job, concerning your affairs in the name of Jesus. Glory. My father, my father, I ask for angelic deployment. Celestial assistance, oh God. In this land that's touching ministry. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Glory to God. In Luke chapter 1 verse 11, the Bible said, And there appeared unto him an angel of the Lord, my God, standing on the right side of the altar of incense, my father, there appeared unto him an angel of the Lord, standing by the right side of the altar of incense. And as you read in verse number 19, the Bible said, and the angel answered, said unto him, I am Gabriel that stand in the presence of God, and I am sent to speak unto thee, and to show thee this glad tidings, my God. He was an angel of good news. Open your mouth therefore and pray, and the man of heaven, let the angel of good news visit my home. Let the angel of good news encounter me, my Father, let the angel of good news visit with my family. Let the angel of good news be sent to me. My father, a visitation of the angel of good news, my God. Let the angel of good news come and facilitate, oh God, to bring to pass your word in my life. Let the angel of good news, my God, let our financial angels go to work now. My father, my father, let the angel of good news be deployed. Unto us, unto me, my God, unto my home, unto my household. The Bible said, Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord. They attend unto our matters. To bring the word of the Lord to pass, my God. That that which was a promise, that that which was a speaking, will become reality. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Glory to God. You are going to open your mouth now and judge every unclean spirit, my God. We will judge every unclean spirit. The Bible said in 2 Corinthians chapter 11 and verse number 14. Mm. Uh -huh. And no marvel, the Bible said, for Satan himself is transformed into an angel of light. We want to judge every unclean spirit. Spirit transforming itself as the angel of light. Judge every unclean spirit from the pit of hell, transforming themselves as the angel of light to deceive. Their operations will not come near me, my father. Their operations will not come near my family. Their operations will not come near my home. Their operations 
operations will not come near the restoration house. My father, Yadia Barabalai, yea, every angel transforming as the angel of light, Kapara, every unclean spirit, they Kopara Kapakata, transforming as the angel of light, Idetete Yagabagadabada, Ikobre de Gedebedebede Yaku Yagoma Santusariata, to deceive me, Predes Yasye, Alubredebegedebe Kurgadagadabadia Kapata. I judge you today, Esliparata Pakatupakata, open your mouth and judge that unclean demon, Ikapare, their operations will not come near thee, Ipatibadibadibadiakata, they shall not come near our dwelling, in Grogodobedebeyegedebedeyadiarada sonsonsondolotos, Seria Barati, Kapakatapatapakataya, Igaberedebedeyegedebedeyegaliadiagabagadai, Ikaberedebedebe, come against their activities, in the name of Jesus, every oppression of unclean spirits, not in our midst, not in our lives, not in our homes, oh God, will cut off the oppressions of unclean spirits in our lives, in our midst, we cast them out in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In First Samuel chapter 28 and verse number 8 and 9, the Bible said, Ah, Zanzara Dinetaria Dakari, Loborodobo Sosopete, and Saul disguised himself and put on other raiments. And he went, and two men went with him, and they came to the woman by night. And he said, I pray thee, divine unto me by the familiar spirits, divine by the familiar spirits, and bring me him, bring me him up whom I shall name unto thee. Verse 9. And the woman said unto him, Behold, thou knowest what Saul had done, how he had cut off those that have familiar spirits and the wizards out of the land. Familiar spirits. They are familiar spirits. And they are men and people that operate by familiar spirits. To bring information, my God, I need you to pray and come against every operation of familiar spirits. Glory to God. The familiar spirits, my father. Familiar spirits follow people. They are called familiar spirits. Familiar spirits are attached to families. They are called familiar spirits. They are familiar with the things that happen. They are familiar. Familiar spirits can bring information about you. Kutipakata Open your mouth and judge every familiar spirit. Every familiar spirit operating around you. Glory to God. Open your mouth and judge them. Yeah, I come against every operation of familiar spirits. They will have no information about me. They will have no information about my children, about our destinies. No information. I judge every familiar spirit operating around me. Every familiar spirit operating in our midst. I bind you today and I cast you out. In the name of Jesus, glory to God. Oh, dear, that's he got the Agaba Gadaba Diatas, Rabuli Bele de Bele de Beneca, he got the Gabagada Gadea, Etromonos, Sondom, Prodogaba Diagabaria Gadia Cata. In the name of Jesus, glory to God. The Bible said in Second Corinthians chapter 10 and verse number 4, he says that the weapon of our warfare is not canal, but mighty true God to the pulling down of strongholds. And every high thing that exalted itself above the knowledge of Christ, bring them to captivity, my God. 
I need you to pray. Come against monitoring spirits. Child of God, you need to pray now. For we are at the cross of the matter for today. You need to pray. Familiar spirits. Glory to God. Monitoring demons. Monitoring spirits are gatekeepers. Glory. Every monitoring spirit. Every gatekeeper demon. Monitoring my bloodline at the Kepeke Tupakaradakata, monitoring my family tree, Ekrogo Shaka Tepakataya, Ebredebede, monitoring that surname that you bear. Open your mouth and pray. Judge every monitoring spirit, monitoring that name, that surname, to bring to pass negative covenants of that name, Billy Grado Kotoko Pekete. Open your mouth and pray. Have anybody in time past and generations past made covenants that opened my family name to demonic interference, my God. Child of God, please pray. Bind every monitoring spirit. Bind every monitoring spirit. Bind every monitoring demon. Monitoring your son name, your last name, your identity, yade katata, every monitoring spirit and gatekeeper spirit, la radika kamoneto, as yes, as a day at the yagadiga, he bovlo protoi, I come against the activities, every activity of monitoring demons, imene bede 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 yakatia, in my life, asasarataka, in the life of my wife, abore bede 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 yagabigiki, ndrososo mene I bind you. I cast you out in the name of Jesus. Child of God, do warfare now. I come against the activities of familiar spirits. I come against the activities of monitoring demons about Tori and Asan de Kabad that have been sent to carry out the verdict of the enemy I cancel them now monitoring the life of my siblings I bind you I cast you out. Glory to God. I put an end to your operations in our midst and lives. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Glory to God. I need you to pray. The Bible said in Acts chapter 5 and verse number 19 that an angel broke him out of prison. Acts chapter 5 and verse number 19 is a attire. But the angel of the Lord by night opened the prison doors and brought them forth and said, Go. Hi, Apelete. The angel of the Lord opened. The prison door and said to them, Go, Hotepekete. I need you therefore to pray that the angel of the Lord be deployed now to break free, to break every prison door, every prison lock, every of our portion that is locked up in the prisons. Open your mouth and begin to demand that the angels of the Lord will go forth now and break every prison door everywhere that our portion is locked up under the sea in ancient forest to Porigadi Kepete every of your portion locked up anywhere I demand let the angels go forth and break every prison door. Break them open. Yeah, and the angel of the Lord showed up in the prison and opened 
Peter and said to them, Go, Afleperadi Pabapata. Is there any in your family that the enemy have put in the prison, in the prison of life, Mengragata Kata? My father, my father, let there be a deployment of angels to that prison. Let every prison door be broken. Let every prison gate be chartered. Atapata para pata pata igabakas zasan san dere te 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 ya data hita agaba vugo bosa koti oli brigade manasari ya tosh ve ete kata bla bla tarapatika pakata my father my father I pray for jail breaks I pray for ayate para pata no sokoto let the prison doors be broken open by the ministry of angels. Dia te bari sasari. Gondioro no sibli tinidar. Ragabaka tu pere de bede bede siasaritas. Oh Lord, lene eten ten se sedit. Betiari te sigamagar. Lobroko tomo siko poronobo dia damadat. Zasami ne bede ya atini da sansan de ritai. Epletika baruba kuria da sente saliga. In the name of Jesus Christ we have prayed. Glory to God. In Second Chronicles. Oh Lord, I saw this scripture long ago. And I prayed. I need you to pray. Second Chronicles chapter 18 and verse 26 the bible said and say thus saith the king a decree had gone forth by the king and that decree was put this fellow in the prison and feed him with the bread of affliction and with the water of affliction until i return oh god a king gave a decree that a certain person be put in prison until he returns. If he is going to return in 10 years, the person remains in prison for 10 years, eating the bread of affliction and drinking the water of affliction. Oh God, God punished Satan. I need you therefore to take a prayer position and begin to upturn every decree, every decree of the ancients, every decree that any king had decreed, every decree that any ban had decreed, that have kept us in prison, that have kept your siblings in prison, eating the bread of affliction and drinking the water of affliction, my God, open your mouth and upturn that decree right now. Begin to come against my father, upturn that decree in the name of Jesus. The Bible said, who says, and it comes to pass when the Lord have not sanctioned it. Open your mouth, therefore, and come against the prison quaternions, no suntara da patia, by the ministry of angels. Glory to God. Let the prison gate be chattered. Adavasa padavasa da bada bada yapakatika. Zio soso bante trete teke tia kabiri koska. My father, my father, pray for your siblings now. Rinda do beko beko te. The man that every decree that have gone forth, that have caused them to eat the bread of affliction and drink the water of affliction. Let that decree be upturned now in the name of Jesus, my God. Every prison door is broken. Glory to God. My Father, my father, we demand, oh God, that the decree be upturned, my father. Let a new decree go forth. Glory to God. Susioria Balitos, Zasa Bagabagadi Gabagadi Yetabere de Benesa. A new decree, oh God, saying, Let my people go. Uli bidi 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 yede bede be yede de bede. Adropa dobo soko pokoti yo bobo dobo yodo. Ete te ne te da yada bali bali kata. Ese separate pete kati yada. Iploto. My father, no more bread of affliction for my siblings. No more water of affliction. And we upon that decree. My father, my father, the prison doors are broken. 
by the ministry of angels. Yes, Lord. Open your mouth and judge the enemy of your soul. Do war now. Every monitoring demon, monitoring that decree to ensure that that decree becomes. Open your mouth and judge them. Bind them today. Send them back to Abes Matea Teaparapata upon that decree in the name of Jesus. No more bread of affliction. No more water of affliction. Every monitoring spirit. Monitoring the decree. We bind you today. We send you back to Abes. The prison door is broken and chattered. Satan will bind you, my father. You unclean demons, you monitoring spirits, you familiar demons. Adamana Santa Yabakuya, a pente yet a menesaka pukulukutu, who venetakwa, who berido siko siko, a minitate in the name of Jesus Christ we have prayed in 2 Kings chapter 25 and verse 29 the Bible said and changed his prison garment and did eat bread continually before him all the days of his life. Now, that, 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 that may not make sense so much to you. But I need to read it from verse number. Uh, let me just take it from 29, 28 and 29. The Bible says, And he spake kindly to him and set his throne above the throne of the kings that were with him in Babylon. Verse 29. And changed his prison garments. And he did eat bread continually before him all the days of his life. This was the restoration of the king. King of Israel, the king of Judah, sorry, Joachim, yes, Joachim, by the king of Babylon, yea, he was brought out of prison, and he was elevated, there was a reign of restoration, my God, can we pray, can we pray, let the reign of restoration fall for my family, let it fall for my siblings, let it fall for the restoration house, oh Lord, I pray, a great day, 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 begin to pray that every prison garment every garment we have worn for all this why let that garment go away the garment of shame every garment of the prison and let it be changed now for my siblings for everyone let every prison garment be removed let every prison garment be taken away let every prison garment be taken away my father every prison garment upon the surname that I bear every prison garment upon my bloodline my God every prison garment upon my siblings my father I destroy by fire every strange garment upon us as a people in the restoration house glory to God every garment that 
that is not of beauty and glory upon your life is destroyed now by fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. Open your mouth, therefore, and come against the ruler, the principality in the region where you dwell. Yes. Come against that principal spirit now. In the name of Jesus, my Father, Yasata Parani Desekeliala, Avaziene Tu Besos, in that nation, glory to God, every demonic spirit, Marudin, Elebere, Tankapasa, going to and fro, so so, they will not see your children, they will not see you, glory to God, Ibaradige Begedegede, subdue that spirit, Ibre Patatata, subdue that demon, Nagabi. That walk in the sons of disobedience. Your children will not become disobedient. That bring worldliness upon the behavior of men. Upon the heart of people. That make wives to become heady and disobedient. Not submissive. That rebellious spirit in the land. The spirit of waywardness, the madness in the land. Open your mouth and bind that spirit. Come against this influence over the land and over the people. Glory to God. And then as he said, Gabaguria talk, Suple Pelete Pecriaga de Gede, Aparapagada Pagadia Gabagada, every unclean spirit, every familiar demon, and the Tumado so, every monitoring spirit, sending information about me. I get the Yakatata, Parapacata Yakata, I destroy their network, I destroy their satellite, Ida Dea Paramigada Bakai, fire in the name. Of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Glory to God. Glory to God. Bless the name of the Lord in thanksgiving. He's the God that answers prayers. Give him thanks now, child of God. Glorify his name. Glorify your name. I glorify your name. I glorify your name in all the earth, Master. Glorify your name. I glorify your name. I glorify your name in all the earth. My Father, let your ministering spirits, let your angelic beings minister to your people. Yes, Lord, in Exodus 23 and 20, Verse 20, you said, I sent my angel before thee to lead you in the way and bring you to the place that is prepared for you. My father, my father, I pray for your people that the angel of light, the angel of the Lord, glory to God, the angel of good news will invade the homes and the life of your people now, oh God, to bring each and every one under the sound of my voice to that prepared place. Yes, to that place of a cup. Pounded harvest, my father, to the place of multiple congratulations. Thank you, Father, for the reign of restoration. It falls now for you. It falls now for your home. It falls now for your business. It falls now for your siblings. It falls now in your father's house. It falls now. This year shall 
end for you in joy. This year shall end for you in great testimonies. This year, Yadamarabada Shatakai shall end for you in good news. Ulebedekere, this year shall end for you with rejoicing and praising my father. Your testimony will pursue you and overtake you. The testimony, my father, Yadamedetai, the angels of the Lord are deployed for your sake. The angels of the Lord go before you. They will bring you in this season to the prepared place, my father. Your portion that is buried, your portion that is imprisoned, is broken loose now, my God. It's a season of multiple congratulations for you, child of God. Your joy will know no bound in the name of Jesus, my God. The activities of monitoring spirits are suspended from your life. The activities of familiar demons are suspended from your life. The angels of God, the ministering spirits of the Lord, go with you in this season. Bring you into your secured place. Bring you in the name oh my god of jesus glory to god i feel god here today glory to god i judge every familiar spirit i judge every monitoring spirit from hell sent by the devil on assignment against your destiny on assignment against your joy on assignment against your fruitfulness i judge them today in the name of jesus and i say to them pack and go be gone forever in the name of jesus every prison door is broken open now by the ministry of angels in the name of Jesus Christ. Glory to God. Thank you, Adonai. Give God praise. Give him thanks. Hallelujah. I feel him here. Glory to God. Thank you. Thank you, my Father. We rejoice in your goodness. Hi, Emenes Suriana Hamdeskesh. In the name of Jesus Christ, we have prayed. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Father. It is done. It is done, child of God. It is done. God, I've gone ahead of you, my God. I see walls being broken down. Thank you, Jesus. I see barriers lifted. Glory to God. Yes, yes. Just like angels invaded Jericho. Oh, get the better super anibatai. So I see angels invading, invading that portion that God have given to you that have been taken from you that was held back, my God. I see angels now. Oh, sniagetes. Glory to God. Let your joy know no bound in the name of Jesus Christ. The days ahead are full of God's blessings for you in the name of Jesus Christ. Your testimony shall come in droves. Glory to God. Glory to God. Give him thanks. Give him praise. He is worthy to be magnified and glorified. Thank you, Adonai. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen and amen. Thank you for joining me in the place of prayer today. The Lord keep you and bless you indeed. Please do well to share this page. Share on your platforms. Share with friends and brethren. Share with family members. I insist your family members. Every one of you must shine your shine. Share with them. Share with them and tell them please pray along. Glory to God.
Share with your friends, okay? The Lord keep you. The Lord bless you. Don't forget to comment and don't forget to share. I'll be here sometime tomorrow to pray as the Lord will guide and lead. Today is the 317th hour of prayer. Tomorrow it will be 318th hour of prayer. Oh, glory to God. Child of God, I can't wait to rejoice with you. I can't wait to dance at the hearing of your testimony. It is well with you in the name of Jesus Christ. That devil is a liar. I tell you the truth. Go in and cast your nets. Yes, irrespective of what you are hearing, cast your nets for a great catch. Because a boat sinking miracle is prepared for you in the now. Hallelujah to Jesus. Divine appointments come at. Hallelujah. Shalom. I'll be with you tomorrow. Don't fail to join me. God bless you. Glory to God. Whoops. What a mighty God we serve. Shalom. Amen.